What's up guys, this is Keith Kelfus, and today we're taking off. We're leaving, we're going away. The wife of Tron and I are going on a much needed vacation. Hey, why are you always folding my clothes? It's, it makes, it makes me feel loved. Now I gotta put them away. Hot woman. Hot woman. Hot woman. Did I just throw on it? This blanket's super delicate. You can't just throw that on there. Because I threw this on here, you're saying it ripped the blanket? Well, it might. It could. And it stinks like freaking gasoline. Take it off. It take, does. Take it off. Take it off. I'm sitting in the garage. You're so aware of these things, my love. I think we need some delicious Tim Hortons coffee. You gotta, like, put that away somewhere. Oh, you good boy. Miko has been diagnosed with mega esophagus. It's a rare dog disorder where the peristalsis effect inside of the esophagus doesn't work anymore. That means the, like how it squeezes the food down, it just doesn't work. So we gotta put him in this special chair that I made by hand. Homemade, homemade, homemade. And we gotta set a timer. Every time he eats or drinks, we have to set the timer for 15 minutes and five minutes. He has to sit upright till it goes down, or you could regurgitate it out and get aspirating pneumonia and die. It's very it's expensive. But he's your good Ewok dog. He's beautiful, isn't he? Oh, he's your good boy. Good boy, good boy. He's a good boy. Good boy, good boy. He's a good boy. Good boy, good boy. Yes, he's a good, good boy. Stop it! String cheesy for that Mickey Meek. Pull it off and give it to him. Mmm. He's a good boy. <laughs> now you gotta hold him up though. So it can go down, Keith. Oh, he's a good boy. Grace has got like three pieces back there. Do you like your string cheese? Huh? Here. Here we are in the hotel room. This is Traverse City, Michigan. It's supposedly the most beautiful place in Michigan by many people say. It's the sun's going down on the water. So Michigan is uh, a mitten and up here at the tip of thumb there's a lot of fun stuff to do. We live down here by Detroit and we drove all the way here to the corner and up in here there's like beautiful lakes the top of Michigan down here is Chicago and where we drove all the way to here and it's beautiful up here the air is clean so we're gonna have lots of fun and I won't be vlogging too much but I still want to show you guys you're acting like it's the Caribbean islands Kelfish. we go to the Caribbean islands every year well when I go I'll vlog it Look at this. Come on, Mickey. Let's go get the poo-poo. That's what I say. Let's go get the poo-poo. Let's go get the poo-poo. He's a good boy. Look at this. This beach. Oh. That's sweet. The sand is so clean. The beach is by my house. Actually, you can't even swim in them because they're like polluted now or something. Look at this beautiful lake. Look at this. This is nice. The dogs are going crazy trying to get to the ducks. If we let them go, they'd swim out there. Go get the ducks. Want to eat out here? Yeah, let's eat out here. Ice cream for the doggies. Guys, there was nothing open to eat because it's so late, so we had to go to McDonald's. There's literally nothing open. 
And so I got the Southwest uh, salad. You put the dressing in there and go like this. Look at that, dude. There's no nutritional value in this at all. We like rarely eat it. McDonald's. There's no doubt it's delicious. It's just I'm not good for you. Honey, when we have kids, whenever we drive past McDonald's, we're gonna brainwash them to go, Yeah, McDonald's. Have you ever seen Eddie Murphy? 1983 Eddie Murphy delirious type it in YouTube if you're a millennial or Eddie Murphy raw if you want to laugh your ass off What about the barbecue sauce? You should that open. Yeah He talks about um When he was a kid he was so poor They couldn't afford to eat McDonald's and all the other kids at school could afford McDonald's and he couldn't and He would Go, Mom, I want McDonald's. And his mom would say, Come on, baby. I'll make you a burger better than McDonald's. I'll make your hamburger better than McDonald's. Right? And he goes, Better than McDonald's? You go better than McDonald's? And then he talked about how his mom would make him... <laughs> He'd be all excited that his mom would make him this burger. It wouldn't even be a burger. It'd be like a big... Um, Meatball with like, we we, didn't, we couldn't afford no uh, hamburger buns. My mom had one of bread and Wonder Bread, and he said there'd be pink. All right, guys, it's the next morning, and you know Holiday Inn has continental breakfast. Oh, 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 deliciousness! They got eggs, cheese. Cheese. They got the bacon and potatoes and the all the biscuits and gravy. Oh, oh no! Hello. We oh, snuck yeah. the egg and cheesy for the doggies. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, get him. Go get him, Grace. Go Yummy. Go get him. Who's the doggies? Go get him. Ready, Mickey? Yeah. Mm, eggs and cheesy. <laughs> here you go, Gracie. Grace, come here. Here, baby. Come here. Gracie, come here, baby. It's okay. Come here. Mm. She don't like eggs. Miko likes eggs. Wow. Traverse City, Michigan. Well, let's go swimming. I knew I heard people in here. needed vacation so the guys are out working right now on a job site and they're good they know what to do we're thinking about buying a piece of property renovating it and turning it into an Airbnb we've known each other on and off since we were teenagers or no yeah I was 16 so we had the same friends 
we both relate, like we listen, to, we like old school, uh, like old hip hop and R&B from the early 2000s. And we met again, we didn't talk for like seven, eight years, and we met again. She was singing and doing music, and so was I. Oh yeah, let's go out there. And she came to my basement recording studio. Instead of doing music, we ended up doing something else. We ended up falling in love. Look at this, an outdoor pool. We got the indoor pool, we got the outdoor pool. I should fly the drone right here, bro. I wonder if they let me. I'm actually selling this right now so I can get the Mavic Air instead because the Mavic Pro has all this setup and breakdown time. You have to take it, you have to take this little cover off that protects the gimbal. See? Then this little plastic protector has to carefully come off that keeps the gimbal locked in place so it's not jiggling all around in transportation because you'll break it. Then open it up and then here's the secret. What I do is I I take the SD chip that's in the camera right now where you're watching this footage with a micro SD adapter and I put it directly into the drone so all the footage is on the same chip and then if you want, you can edit directly on your phone by putting the micro SD if you've got an Android device, like an LG V30 or a Note 8, and then you can edit on Power Director 8, and then you don't have to, it, it just simplifies and condenses the whole process. So let's fly the drone. Oh, look at the Mr. Duckies. Oh, they're so cute. Oh. Back in the day, we would feed uh, Canadian geese, and they got to the point where they trusted her and they would come up and eat right out of her hand and she'd pet them. <laughs> Look, but um, I'm seeing if I can rent jet skis right now, bro. I wanna go on a jet ski, I'm, I'm obsessed. Like I went on a jet ski once when I was 13 and I've been going on Craigslist and Facebook Marketplace trying to look, but that's a shitty investment, it's stupid. It doesn't make you money, so it's like, you know, but I'm craving to go on a jet ski, man. If you ride jet skis and you know what I'm talking about, let me know. Hey, I want to tell you a quick story about eternity. So, at like the sands of the hourglass, these are the days of our lives. Watch. All right, yo. I got my travel rewards card with the $5,000 limit. Spent seven years digging in the dirt, rebuilding my credit, and there's the boat rental. Oh my god, I'm going on jet skis. Yeah, dog. The wife of Tron fell off a jet ski when she was a little bit younger and broke a bone in her face. So she doesn't want to go, but she was also on the jet ski with someone else and they are drunk or something. I don't know. But this is going to be good. They were literally looking at me like I was on drugs. They're like, why is it? Because I couldn't stop smiling. <laughs> Hey, honey. Okay, I'm renting a jet ski for sure, right now. You want a jet ski? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. Oh, I gotta go all the way back to ask him how old you gotta be. Well, yeah. Damn it. Oh, what the? <laughs> Dude, I'm so, oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so. <laughs> Have you ever, have you ever heard, have you ever heard Daniel Tosh talk about going on jet skis? How am I supposed to vlog in jet ski? Oh shit, no. <laughs> okay, one hand is vlogging jet skis.
But as soon as I took off, dude, it's like a rocket, and I was just screaming. Dude, I'm so happy right now. I wanted to fly the drone in follow me mode, but I don't know how I would carry the controller, and I've never done it, so I don't want to lose my $1,000 drone, but I'm going to do it. It doesn't make, it doesn't count if you talk about it. So I'm going to have a blast. And later. Look, this thing goes way faster than I was going just now in the video. Like, it's like being on a rocket, man. You're like, no, it's not selfish. I have a jet ski that does 85 miles per hour. Well, that's fast as shit to me, bro. <laughs> this is dope, dude. This is dope. Yeah, I feel called to say this real quick. Um, if you struggle with drugs at all, uh, I want you to go find uh, a YouTuber by the name of Tigran Gertz, T-I-G-R-A-N-G-E-R-T-Z, and go find his video where he talks about how he struggled back in the day, uh, and this dude turned his whole life around, and now he's soaring, and it's a really powerful, inspiring, amazing video. I watched like the video, and I loved it. So, Tigran, if anybody is here. Find Tigran, find him in the comments, and post that video below in the comments. You gotta find that video. If you're struggling, you gotta watch Tigran's video. It's very powerful. Look, look what they're doing here at the Holiday Inn, man. Cleaning windows with a water-fed pole system and the Unger Hydro Power. Yeah, dog. There you go. This is straight up downtown Traverse City. This is beautiful. We're trying to find a place to eat and left the dogs back in. Oh, this looks good. It looks like there's a... Look at that wait. Look at this. Tacos and chips and salsa and guacamole. I'm down. You down? You want to look more? She wants to look more. This is tomato soup. Looks more like tomato goulash. Let's try it and see how good it is. It's amazing. I love it. So, we're going back to the hotel. You got the chicken for the doggies. Here, we take this one. Thanks. And um, 
I was so glad I got this HP Spectre uh, 360 convertible whatever laptop off Best Buy because now I can, if we're on vacation, I can start uploading this footage with the Wi-Fi at the hotel. And I debated, I sat there, I didn't wanna, cause if you buy a laptop, I needed a laptop, when you need a laptop, if you buy a crappy cheap one, you're gonna regret it immediately, but it's hard to cough up the money on an expensive one, especially like a Mac. But I'm so glad I did, because now I just, I have this one client who's like really wealthy. He's like, you have to have the best of technology so you can always be on the cutting edge above everybody else. There's no option. I was like, ugh. It's easy for him to say, right? But it's true when you invest in good stuff or good tools. Still easy to say. It depends Hi. On then it's a lot faster. What is that, honey? Oh, the dog pooped on the ground. We need to clean that up. Oh, the babies. Who's the babies? Who's the babies? It's okay, my lover, baby. I love you. Who is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, the Mickey. He's a good boy. Love, love, love these dogs. Where's your toys? Huh? Where? Where is it? Where is the baby? So look at these dudes. Uh, you might have seen this already. Look at these dudes. You gotta see this. It's insane. Like, because we do landscaping, these dudes build like an entire pool by hand with no tools. It's insane, dude. Alright, guys, so that's the end of this vlog. And thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. We're gonna cuddle up and watch a movie and enjoy the rest of our vacay. Baby shark, baby shark. If you didn't see the vlog before this, click the link in the description below for. Anyways. All right, so I'm trying to do a uh, vlog more often. When I first started this channel, vlogged obsessively, and it can really take a toll if you're doing it all the time, if you don't kind of have your system down, and there's different phases in life, but now I'm excited and on fire. I hope you are. If you want to start a YouTube channel and you want to vlog, just literally just pull the trigger and start doing it and stop analyzing. And uh, it's fun. YouTube has changed my life. And if you have a message you want to share with the world and something you have inside of you, start with your cell phone. Just start posting videos and getting your message out there. I mean, we're in 2018. This is this is it. So, oh, who's the doggy? All right, later. Peace.